Back in 2015, Paladins actually started out as a passion project. We just wanted to make an awesome competitive game. And now, 25 million people later, we just can't believe what Paladins has grown into. We wanted to make a good game, man. We wanted to make something that was fun, something that was new, um, appealed to a large group of people. So the initial goals of Paladins was to create a really fun first-person hero shooter that had kind of a more whimsical feel to it. And there were a lot of different ideas we wanted to mesh together. Um, the cards, the mounts, plus the first-person shooter combat, and the objective-based gameplay. And it kind of felt like the Wild West. There was a, a little bit of a different goal, I think, every day overarching. I think they were just trying to find the fun. So early on in the development process of Paladins, we wanted to get the community, the alpha testing community, playing what we were playing on the dev side. So it's definitely about iterating upon different design aspects and kind of figuring out what was fun, what worked, what our players liked, and continuing along that path. We were so surprised Paladins came out on Steam and it became the most played new game release on Steam that year. Even today, it's in the top 20 almost every day and we're continually just blown away by the support our community gives us. It was a concept and a, and a project based around, I think, a lot of good people with a great idea. And, and I always trusted the fact that there are a lot of good people here at Hi-Rez, so I feel confident that this is going to turn into something worthwhile, and it certainly did. You know, we're constantly listening to our community, and they actually have a lot of sway over what our decisions are, and you know, you've seen us take back things depending on community reaction. So I think it's nice that we're so involved, and people can feel like they're playing a game that they have a part in making. So there are a lot of changes that we've made in the game that have come from kind of community response. In OB64, we reverted that and we did kind of a big crappy art campaign, which was a lot of fun. Seeing it evolve over the years has been just awesome. And uh, the state it's in now is just so much fun and it's come such a long way from where we started. It's really a treat to be able to share that passion with people who also have a passion for games and just have fun with it. Everyone at High res wants to make the best possible game you know, on whatever team that they're working on. And Paladins is no exception to that. I think the driving goal is to build games that we ourselves want to play. Paladins has evolved to be a really great eSport. We started out with uh, a sanction from WESA, the World eSports Association, the only second title to achieve that sanctioning. And looking at 2018, we anticipate more teams, more great prizing, and bigger and better eSports. You know, working on this game for so many years and starting off with such a small team and seeing it grow not only on the dev side but also from a community perspective, uh, without you guys none of this could exist and uh, it's why we do what we do. Every little thing we've come so far and we're not done yet, right? There's a lot more that we can do, there's a lot more that this game can grow and, and develop and I'm just really excited for the future. The way that our players have attached to our characters, attached to our game and supported us is really good and we only hope to um, impress them more and make them proud in the future with all of our new pieces of content and I think we're going to kick its ass because we have some really dope things coming. I'm super excited that we're finally here. You know, me and the team have the opportunity to come in every day and build a game that we love and also the community loves and you know, we're just excited about to see how Paladins will grow into the future. So from that original goal of just building a great competitive shooter, we've come quite a long way. We've taken a few detours and corrections along the way, but at this point, with the launch of Paladins, we're all looking forward to a very bright future.